And this is why Harry and Meghan's recent activity makes sense in an American context. They've started podcasts, developed reality TV shows, they've given tell-all interviews, and Harry has written a tell-all book, which includes details about killing 25 people, uh, banging someone in a field behind a pub, and snorting coke, among other adventures, including a very cold penis. But in doing this, Harry isn't rejecting monarchy. He's simply transitioning to being a proper American royal. He's being more vulnerable in revealing personal details, but he's doing it all for profit, making millions in TV and publishing deals along the way. And this is because Harry and Meghan get that to become an American royal is basically just to become a Kardashian.